Hello, everyone, and welcome to another episode of Deadly Destinations, where we explore the spookiest and the most haunted places in America. And I am Christy, and I'm joined by Philip. Hi there. Today, we're taking you to one of the oldest cities in the United States, St. Augustine, Florida, to the infamous St. Augustine Lighthouse. The lighthouse has been standing for over 140 years and has a rich history of shipwrecks and ghost sightings. In fact, the lighthouse has been featured on several paranormal TV shows and has been investigated by many ghost hunters. Do you watch any of the, have you watched any of the paranormal shows? The ghost hunters and stuff? No. I know some of their names, you know, obviously like Zach Baggins, he's here and he has his um, right. his haunted museum, which is actually just a couple streets over from Nightmare Toys. So it's real, it's, it's real close. Um, and we have been there and that was tons of fun. But uh, I haven't watched a whole lot of the uh, ghost hunter shows or anything like that. No, though. I've been to lighthouses. I've been to a lot of lighthouses. See, I have not done that. And I love lighthouses. Uh, I would love to go to a lighthouse. I have not done that, though. So that's fun. Yeah, Where I'm, did you go to a lighthouse at, Philip? Um, probably the most popular one is the one in Montauk, um, New York. I went to that one. Uh, I went to a bunch on the east, you know, up northeast. Some of the most famous ghost stories associated with the lighthouse include the ghost of a former li lighthouse keeper and his daughter who died tragically in a shipwreck. Legend has it that the keeper's daughter still run the lighthouse playing pranks on visitors and appearing as ghostly apparitions. My favorite thing is prank videos, so uh, <laughs> if there was a prank ghost, I would totally be down for that. <laughs> I, don't, I don't know what kind of pranks they play, but sounds fun. Lighthouses like like aren't that big though, right? It's just kind of like walking like they're big as far as like big as in tall, tall but not like a lot of space is what I'm trying to right. say. You got, you know, like a spiral staircase or whatever to go all the way up to the top. So I mean that'd be kinda of scary if you've seen a ghost in a lighthouse, you ain't got too far to go except the, taking the stairs up or down and Yeah. Right? <laughs> Another spooky tale involves the ghost of a woman who fell to her death while painting the lighthouse. Her ghost is said to haunt the tower, and many visitors have reported seeing her apparition. I mean, to fall to your death while you're painting the lighthouse? Yeah. Yeah, he's probably haunting the, the whole place. Mm-hmm. So we need to go check that out then next time we're in Florida. If you're feeling brave, you can still visit the lighthouse and even climb the 219 steps to the top for a breathtaking view of St. Augustine. So if you're ever in Florida and looking for a spooky adventure, be sure to check out the St. Augustine Lighthouse. That's all for today's episode of Deadly Destinations. Join us next time as we explore more haunted places around the world. Thanks for watching and have a spooky day. Bye. Bye.